In this video I will show you how to install the latest stable version of Arduino IDE on your Mac. First step, open your favorite web browser. I will just stick to Safari. You want to download Arduino IDE directly from the Arduino website, not from where Google or some shady ad tells you to download it. You want the latest stable version without viruses. So let's go to arduino.cc, head over to software. And now the important thing, you don't want to download nightly builds because they might have some bugs. There is actually two options for you. There is the Intel version and the Apple Silicon version. If you're not sure which one to pick, click on the Apple symbol about this Mac. If the chip is an Apple M something, then you need to download the Apple Silicon version. And if the chip is an Intel something, you need to download the Intel version. In my case, I will go with the Apple Silicon version. Now Arduino tries to get some money from you. I already bought a lot of Arduinos, so I will just download it. I will allow the download. Now you should find your DMG file inside of your downloads. And all you need to do is drag and drop Arduino ID into your applications folder. Now once this is done, we can start Arduino ID. I will close everything. Can eject the Arduino ID installer volume. And now there is multiple options. You can start a new window and go to the application folder or you press command space and search for Arduino IDE. Press enter. Then it will warn you because we downloaded it directly from Arduino CC. Open it. Now it wants to access my files. That's all right. And now it is downloading some stuff. Just don't close it at this point. Let it do its thing. Once we are finished, it won't really tell you, but there is nothing more happening. I'm going to test my installation using my Arduino Uno. I will connect the Arduino board to my MacBook. And now I should be able to select my Arduino board. Right now, I don't see my Arduino board. I just see an unknown wireless LAN debug connection or Bluetooth, but we are connected using USB. It should look different. What you need to do is sometimes you need to unplug and replug it. macOS will ask you to allow the connection to the external device. I need to allow the connection. And now Arduino Uno should finally show up in this dialog. Select the Arduino Uno. To test our setup, press the upload button right here. It should compile the sketch and it should upload the sketch to the Arduino board. If there is no error, everything worked. Now, if it didn't work for you, please let me know in the comments down below. If it worked for you, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel if you're ready to dive deep into the world of Arduino. If you found this video helpful, you'll definitely want to check out this one. Thank you for watching. See you next time.